They say you are what you eat, which leaves me with a question about this food on my plate and its impending digestion. How this protein, fat, and carbohydrate that you see is gonna get broken down and rebuilt into me. Ingestion's a start, it's when you take the food in, breaking down the food, that's digestion. And then the food gets absorbed or assimilated. What you can't absorb, it's gotta be eliminated. Chewing and grinding food to form so little, that kind of digestion is mechanical. And enzymes breaking polymers to monomers so simple, that kind of digestion is chemical. In most animals, earthworms, gnats, or rats, there's a tube that's called the digestive tract. Attached to the tract are parts that secrete enzymes and juices to break down what you eat. Breaking food down in your digestive tract, polymers to monomers, enzyme attack. Food becomes kind, disassembly line. You are what you eat, so watch how you dine. Liver and pancreas keep on secreting juices for treating the food you've been eating. Mouth to esophagus, stomach, intestine, colon to rectum to anus digestion. The teeth grind food increasing surface area of any food you'd find in any cafeteria the salivary glands release salivary amylase which chemically digests starch and carbohydrate then swallowing moves food to the esophagus choking is prevented by the epiglottis which covers up the windpipe so you won't choke or cough the epiglottis seals the trachea off peristalsis moves food through the digestive tract and waves smooth muscles contract and relax so it's not gravity that moves the food from place to place you can eat upside down or in outer space the stomach's the next place your food will go. Hydrochloric acid makes the pH low. The low pH makes proteins relax, setting them up for enzyme attack. Pepsinogens, an enzyme that the stomach secretes. Acid makes it into pepsin, which breaks apart proteins. A soupy mixture known as acid chyme forms in your tummy. It's what you vomit when you're sick. It's anything but yummy. The stomach sends a chyme on the next step on this trip. Pyloric sphincter opens, allowing chyme to drip into the duodenum, the start of the intestine, leading us into another moment in digestion. Breaking food down in your digestive tract. Polymers to monomers, enzyme attack Food becomes kind, disassembly line You are what you eat, so watch how you dine Liver and pancreas keep on secreting Jesus for treating the food you've been eating Mouth to esophagus, stomach, intestine, colon to rectum to anus digestion Now it's time for bile, that bitter green secretion Whose job is to emulsify the fat that you've been eating The gallbladder stores bile that the liver synthesizes Fat gobs are split into digestible sizes The duodenum gets the bile from the bile duct And more secretion coming through the pancreatic duct. Bicarbonate is one. Its job is to neutralize the acid from the stomach so intestines will be alkaline. And this pancreatic juice, it's an enzymatic brew with amylase and protease and lipase and that's due. As food moves along, enzymes break down each polymer until nothing's left of food but the simplest monomers. We're ready for absorption, no cause for confusion. Food moves from intestines to the bloodstream by diffusion. The intestines really increase surface for absorption. Food diffuses into blood no matter what the portion. Breaking food down in your digestive tract. Polymers to monomers enzyme attack. Food becomes kind, disassembly line. You are what you eat, so watch how you dine. Liver and pancreas keep on secreting. Juices for treating the food you've been eating. Mouth to esophagus, stomach, intestine, colon to rectum to anus digestion. After this absorption, the system may rest and what's left moves to the colon, the large intestine. Feces forms from indigestible food and fiber. It's the same in earthworms, antelopes, or tigers. Reabsorbing water, it's a main colonic function. It flows from the colon to the blood without compunction. And you can thank the bacteria in your colon for synthesizing vitamin K and biotin. But other colonic things ain't so cute. The gas is parts that make us too. Nitrogen, hydrogen, CO2, and methane, the last ones cause climate change. The appendix is a little patch, it sometimes can excite us. When it's inflamed, it causes pain, it's called appendicitis. It's functionless vestigial, so you can take mine out of me. It's surgical removal, it's called an appendectomy. The rectum's the last stop on this pathway within us. The feces is stored till it exits out the anus. What started as food now meets its final fate. As it exits out the body, as we eliminate. Breaking food down in your digestive tract. Polymers to monomers, enzyme attack. Food becomes kind, disassembly line. You are what you eat, so watch how you dine. Liver and pancreas keep on secreting juices for treating the food you've been eating mouth to esophagus stomach intestine colon to rectum to anus digestion breaking food down in your digestive tract polymers to monomers enzyme attack food becomes kind disassembly line you are what you eat so watch how you dine liver and pancreas keep on secreting juices for treating the food you've been eating mouth to esophagus stomach intestine colon to rectum to anus digestion Thank you.